Now, in the next programme, it is going to basically ask for some test marks. There's the uh, class of 12 sitting tests. If you scored over 40 in a test out of 60, it's going to add one to a counter. So it's basically going to count all the pupils that have scored more than 40 in the test. Okay, so it's called over 40. Put my name in there. Okay, so what you've got is you're wanting to have two variables, one for the test score and then the other for um, the total of the number of pupils that are over 40. So we're going to declare them and initialize them. And it's going to be integers. So what we're then going to just do is ask for the, the score. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to ask for the score 12 times as a number of pupils. Do, 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 12 times. Okay, so we're going to say for counter. Now we're not going to use a counter, we're not outputting any value from the counter, so we'll just use it in range 12. Okay, we're not going to output uh, any counter value into this, so we'll just stick with this one as I'm just repeating myself. So we'll say score equals, and then we're just going to say well, that's an integer. And then we're just going to go input. If I could spell input, so that would be a good start. And then please enter your score. Now it's not asked to validate it to make sure it's between 0 and 60. If it did, then you'd have to implement that. All we're going to say is though, if score is greater than 40, then we're going to add 1 to a total, so this is a wee running total, so we're going to say, well, the value of total is going to equal to total plus 1. So the first time, total is equal to 0, but as soon as it finds a value that's bigger than, a score bigger than 40, I'll add 1 to that total, so it's 0 plus 1, so total now is equal to 1. We can then say print, and we'll just say print number of students, number of pupils, that score more than 40 is, and then we'll just output that variable called total. And that hopefully works first time. Right. So, one, two, three. Four, five. So, five numbers that are greater than 40, and it's totaled that up and it's output it as five. Okay, so that's that program working.